Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of EverQuest Old School. And tonight's a very special episode. We are playing our mains, as you can see. Now, I have a few friends with us. We have uh, Dark Dragon. Yo. We also have uh, Bushido Bull. Hey, hey. And last but not least, guys, we have Hydros Inc. with us tonight. Boom! The Barbarian! That bird sells food. <laughs> <laughs> the bird sells food. They will sell me crap, dude. They hate me. I, I have to sneak behind them. Oh, yeah, because you can't get faction over here. You can't get good faction or bad faction what? because of the way it's somebody set up right now. Me, Does anybody need somebody left me a comment saying it was uh, based on your race. The AVX will sell or not sell to you based on your race. Yeah, but you used to be able to increase sell. it. Because I remember my, my Shadow Knight it? my Shadow Knight used to come over here and hunt. And he got good enough action where he could go up there and sell. I don't remember what he had to kill to do it, really? but he, yeah, he got good ABX enough action. Are being camped. I thought there was no they faction for the ABX. No, there's a negative faction for these guys as well, but it's not on this server. You know, it's it's not on here right now. And I don't know if, if sometime they're going to put it in, but for now, there's no faction with these guys or the centaurs. And I could have swore the centaurs were kill on sight to my dark elf. Uh, every time he came into the zone, I always had to worry about those stupid arrows flying out from farther than you could actually see because they have just enormous range on their their archers. Uh, where are you going? Are you going up? I'm going up. I thought oh, we were going over yeah, to Paul. Uh, well, yeah, going going, I got sale, my food. So. Oh, okay, that's so, right. I'm, I'm going to run up here and I'm going to con this guy. And if he's low enough food level, food? we're all going to kill him. Since he won't sell to me. Uh, I could use like tent water. I'll get you a stat. <laughs> I think I'm good I wonder if I get mind. behind him and crouch. I wonder if I get behind him and crouch down and feel sell to me. I can let's, use let's a, a little bit of food. Yeah, I got ten. I'm, I'm good. That's it. Assuming he sells food. Hold on, let me see if I if I need food or water. I got two water. I got lots of fine steel. Eleven food. And there's that. I got short twelve tail. water. Let's see yeah, if I can I pick out what, what races we got over here. We got a barbarian, probably shaman. Looks like from the equipment they got. But you know, I could use a stack of food, please, and I'm sorry, AC, for interrupting you, sir. No, that's a rumor. Yeah. He a has wizard. no food or water. Oh, By that's way, awesome. This is my new bow. It's a druid over there, Giffen. It's probably a druid. That's it's probably a ranger. like me that'll ruin his land, dude. So. And I'm guessing Enchanter? Yeah, because he has a mez. He has a charm, All right, actually. guys. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, that was good. Okay, here we go. Oh, she has a shovel. oh, that might I be live. A mage. What did you do? Yeah, what you doing, man? Did you? I jumped off uh, one level and then I jumped off the next level because it was there. Yeah, but and it I takes was... a little bit of power to heal back up. So. Aw. Yeah. Why don't you sit down and get some power back, guy? Oh. Head in the bar. You're sitting waiting. On you. Where you is get, everybody? Give, give me a hug. Oh, they're up there. Nah, get away from him, man. Where's the get where's away. the gnome at? Get away. <laughs> get away He's invisible. Get in. Give me give me a hug, guy. Come on. Where, where's that? <laughs> bring it in. Wanna, bring it in. I don't want to go away. Where's Bushido? <laughs> uh, he's up there selling. Oh, okay. He knows the way to put all this go. Uh, there's no food. Do we have the gnome with us? Yep. Um, I'm standing right in front of you now that you're walking. All right, Alard, come on. Take us to take us to the the split pole. The pole, hey, please. Can't clear it. Summon food. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Summon food and water. Where are you going? Time. That's not the right way. Where are you going, Alar? Why are you chasing that guy? That's not the way to split ball. Are you actually going this way? Oh, there's. <laughs> I think he is a little bit. <laughs> I thought that was you for a second. <laughs> Watch uh, out for this cyclops. He is yellow. We could actually kill that guy. Oh, let's kill. Where's he at? Where's he at? He's over is there in the distance. Oh, okay, I'm on his ass. Oh, let's Why go get him. Let's go get him. Be I like killing that cyclops. Now, have you done this before? Have we? I don't think we killed this guy before. Uh, I think me and maybe uh, yeah, Dark Dragon not killed him. Dark. Yeah, I think we killed him when I, and we've killed plenty of Cyclops over in uh, the Wrath of Mountains. Yeah, I can't wait till we're higher I level. Was... And we can go over there and kill some of those giants. We've been talking about that for a while, but uh, it's gonna be pretty nice to be able to do that. And in the future, Ooh, guys, yeah. we're actually talking about some of the places we want to go, and we have uh, Soul A, Crystal uh, Caverns. Yeah, Crystal Caverns, Najina. We want to go back and do that one. Uh, is this guy ready to attack? Maybe. If we're going to go back and do Najina, we need to do it soon because we're actually about to out-level Najina. It said all the way up to level 35. That's fine. 
all the way down in the basement. So. Oh yeah, I think the leader, the leader is pretty. There are several he's creatures. No, no slouch. There are several creatures What's that have on the list Cyclops? that were that were down there. But yeah, one of the places I really really want to go is uh, Soul A, just because it has quite a few things down there. It has a Tinkerer's bag that you can buy from one of the NPCs. Uh, I don't Sunday. know how much it costs, but definitely want to get that for some of our characters because it's very easy to get overweight in this game. It also has a charged shield for clerics that hit something like nine wisdom or something, and it's pretty nice. So it'd be nice to get that for not only my cleric, but for Thum's uh, Druid. And any of you guys, do you have any healers other than uh, Shalara? Shalara probably could use that as well. What? It's a charred guardian shield. It's uh, I think it's like nine wisdom or something along those lines. Seven AC, so it's really really nice. Thum, you're actually taking damage, and why am I? I'm Zerker. I'm Zerker, baby. No, it's cool. I'm Zerker. Oh, never oh, mind. Oh, he's after the gnome. Oh, he spotted the gnome. And in case you guys were wondering why I was oh. using my melee or melee <laughs> instead of using uh, my power, it's because we just switched over for my monk. And I completely forgot I was playing my cleric, so. <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome, dude. <laughs> I completely fought that entire fight, and, and it that didn't do amazing. anything. I didn't do any damage. <laughs> oh, that's precious. <laughs> that is horrible. Oh, that, is, that is why you don't switch back and forth between a class like that and then back to this one. It's completely different. But, uh, yeah, I'm liking both of them. I'm liking the monk a lot. Uh, what about you guys? What do you think yeah. of him so far? I love my monk. I love Tusk. He's so much fun to play. I think I would probably pick Thum over him, but, uh, you know, it doesn't matter. It's, it's uh, you know, uh, my three friends here, they helped me decide what we're going to play tonight. Tonight we decided, while we are waiting for another friend to get on, that we were going to play the, the monks, and we had a great time, guys. We had a full group. We had a couple of friends. Um, what was his name? Savak? Uh, yeah, one of the yep. viewers, he came out and hung out with us. Got Savik, well, man, we, we, it was great to have you. And yeah, it would have uh, been nice if Alar was in the group. Then we could have gotten XP for that. Did I steal XP? Oh, oh man, that is why you guys don't give me leadership because I just do not pay attention. Holy crap, you're almost dead too. Jeez, first I'm playing like a monk, then I forget to get somebody in the group. I do I apologize. Heal me. Well, I got you there. Yeah. I don't know how he stole that. I don't know how he stole uh. He's a rogue, yeah, man. really. How did because I kill from it was, both it of was basically you and him DPSing. I got here when he was half dead. So let's go ahead and That's run nice. all over uh, to the area that we're going to. Is it uh, Split Paul, right? Split Paul, uh, yeah, it's this way. There we I go. thought you dotted him up there at the end, dude. Yeah, but I mean, even yeah, if he did it at the he end. He was already half dead. All you got to do is hey, uh, 70%. That yellow gave me 6% uh, of experience. Actually, he oh, just has to do fifty-one percent. He just has to do just one more percent than we can possibly do together, uh, and he wins. So, yeah, that's probably not too hard for a rogue, especially considering you were tanking it pretty well. So he was just sitting in the back, you know, backstabbing it, which is what we want. We just want him in the group. So, <laughs> so you could have got some of that six percent. Well, six percent is pretty nice. We might think about doing that to power level people in the future, to uh, a certain point. You know, if somebody's coming along and they might be too low, we. Oh, sorry guys, we can just tank it and have them come back in the, you know, from behind and just sit there and, you know, get the life down little by little. And as long as they're not too low, they should be able to handle it fairly well. This is camped well out here, so. <laughs> is so everyone this, with me? This guy's still alive. Yep, he's faking it. Go ahead and toss him an invite. Maybe he'll join us. Don't do it. It's a trap. Hey, what is he? How's he going? <laughs> oh, look, it's a half naked. Hey, hey. On, just so you know, hey, hold on, hold on. Mickey O right here was looking for a res. Yeah. A res or uh, a revive? Because I can give her a re revive, but she won't get any experience back. Well, it's yeah. basically the same thing. But, no, no, there's I very, very different things for a lot of people. There's he said he was about to make known as Paul. Right, join. Here we go, guys. Paul, guys. First time in this zone since we've been back. In fact, I don't think I ever really came down here the last time I played because it is a zone out in the middle of nowhere, and then it's a dungeon within that zone that you need a group to kind of come in here with, and this isn't a zone that a lot of people will group in all that often. So, yeah, this is this is going to be interesting. Plus, by the time I was able to come in here, I was already heading over to High Keep to get all that uh, great dungeon yeah. experience. and. Yeah. Uh, good, you know, quest items and having the bank right there next to you and just a, a tremendous 
you know, safety net of having those guards and the zone line so close. So I, I loved it over there. But it's going to be interesting to check this out. You guys at home will have to let us know if you've been in here before. Uh, is that a pet of one of the mobs? Yeah, that's the a pet of one of the gnolls. Hmm. I hated this zone. I He's always hate this zone. He's blue, so that might be... In fact, let's uh, let Alar go out there and see what's up before we pull anything. Oh, well, I can't attack this guy. Because he's not supposed to be there. I bet he's on the floor above or the floor below, and he's just yeah, kind of glitching out here. Anything. Yeah, he won't let me attack him. So now I know there's pops right here. It's been a long time since I've been in here. Like, since yeah. 2003, 2004, guys, so... There's a single no here, but he's red. I have to say the old memory's rusty. Okay, well, I'm at 26%, uh, so you guys can pull. That's no, that's Just don't not, pull reds. No. Uh, reds will be a little bit too tough for me at the moment. He is he is very, very red, sir. And very, very angry about being red. Is that He's the only mob neck. you can pull? Well, that's, that's the only, the only one, one available pull, right yeah. now. It may be too tough for us to be in here. We might have to go out there to the outside and just kill guys uh, out there's there. There's a blue just a little further in. If we can kill the red just to get by him. Uh, well, we're we gonna can, try the red. We're just yeah. gonna wait until our cleric's full, yeah. full mana before we before and we try him. Right here, Tish falls. Uh, blue back here, two blues. Okay, so we just got on, unlucky on that, that one. Cyclops was red to me too. Okay, I'm gonna scout up to the uh, the double doors and just see what's just beyond them. Yeah, see if there's any names up. Maybe we can uh, move a little further in. So this is gonna be a little while before I get up to uh, full power. I'm only at 40%, so if you want to go in there and take a look around. Now, did any of you guys ever Hello. come here back in the day? Did you spend a lot of time here? Are you aware of where like I, the group sit? I think we had a guild event here one time. I think uh, when our guild was starting out, we all came over here on a mini raid. It was like, uh, you know, let's go wipe out the, the um, split hall. So I, I remember something like that. Uh, our actually... The leader of our guild, uh, who's Thomas, he was a real life friend back in the day. He would do stuff like that. He would uh, train us on how to raid. He was getting us ready to raid the bigger, the bigger, you know, like plane of hate and plane of fear and all that stuff. And and I have to say that because we went in and we did these smaller dungeons and worked as a group, learned to work as a guild, it actually did translate into us doing better when it went time. We got time for us to get to the bigger raids. So, I mean, uh, you know, and of course, I was one of the founding members. I was one of the first 10 members of the guild, and and uh, it was all, we all started off with real life friends. There was like maybe nine, ten. So I know we had enough to start the guild. And uh, we started off uh, immediately because uh, we were called the Age of Apocalypse. We got about 30 people, uh, and we would we would go on mini raids. We would, and we came to Split Paul, we did a mini raid, and I remember there was a couple of dungeons over in Kunark that we uh, did mini raids on, so... Yeah, it was awesome. So that's, I have been in here, but it's been a long time ago. That's cool, man. That you got to work on the fundamentals before you get to the big raids. And some people are very nervous about going into a raid because they've never done it before, and they know that there's a lot of pressure. And if you mess up, everybody dies. So it's nice that you guys took the time to come to a like a lower level zone almost, and you know share some of that knowledge <laughs> with people and get them in the the groove of doing it before you go to like the plan of hate or the plan of fear, which is definitely one of those. Uh, I would say pretty tough. I mean, for a brand new person coming to raiding for the, uh, the very first time, those are going to pose some issues. Uh, figuring out how to pull the mobs and then, of course, how to fight the mobs is usually the hardest thing. Figuring out when to cast your uh, cure diseases and whether you have to or not. Uh, some mobs, you know, if you don't cure that disease the moment it gets put on people, they just die instantly and everything's done with. So you got to be on the ball with that other one. Chain hills. Yeah, chain, chain hills. hills yeah. And stuff, yeah. It takes a little while before you get in the groove oh, of doing pop. that. Especially if you're if you're the first cleric to do it, uh, you just have to be very quick. But if you're the guy yeah. in say the middle, the third guy or the fourth guy down oh, the right row, the end, it'll pop right there to the the other side of him. Now what is this guy Condi blue? Okay, that's he's not too good. Yeah. He's the weaker of the guys in here. These are the guys I was soloing. Yeah, these are the guys. Oh, if we. Uh, what is your deal, man? Leave me alone. Uh, he sit aggro. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and sit back down. Yeah, we're we're not even taking very much damage at all with your your AC. Now, what are you at with yours right now? My AC is uh, six hundred and fifty. So unbuffed. Jeez. That's unbuffed. Unbuffed five seventy six. Here. My attack is six hundred and sixty nine. Whatever that means. Um, I hope that's good. I wanna, well, I did not mean to do that. hitting the mob. Okay. There's a little quip saying he wants to be buffed up right now, guys. 
<laughs> no, no. Did I say unbuff? <laughs> <laughs> it's just so hard to tell whether I should buff them up or wait for my power to go back up to full so we can actually well, pull one of these creatures. But I, I'll give you your buff because you do need it, and it does help out a great deal to have just that extra little bit of AC. So. Okay, so you just raised my hit points to 1163 uh, and my AC up to 672. So, very nice. Yeah, definitely Very happy it. about bugging my cleric for, for buffs. Yeah, I shouldn't. Uh, you shouldn't have to bug me to get it, but, you know, unfortunately, I did <laughs> just switch good. over from playing a monk, hey, look. so I'm still in the, the phase of why don't I go up there and punch it in the face a few times. And <laughs> Yeah, the monks are... The, I think the monks are fun for everybody. The only the only person who's probably not having the most fun is is Dark Dragon who's playing Shalari. He's our healer. He's our shaman, but we love having him. We love having the slows. I mean, the slow alone uh, saved him. Huh? What's up? Uh, loot that it's, should be a fine steel weapon. I bet he's still having a good time. I can't speak for him, but I, I imagine as a healer, uh, it's still very enjoyable. You just have to find that Ooh, that class gosh. that you excel at that you're happy That's with. Some, sorry, sorry, AC. There's something here for us to roll on. Oh, what is it? Really. Yeah, it's a split pole eye, guys. It's uh, it's got five charges on it. it Glimps, it's only about a couple copper pieces at the vendor. Yeah, yes. but I mean, I would like to use something like that. I would like to actually it, click it on has, it. Uh, go for it, then, man. Go for it. I'll random you just for fun of it to see, you know, what we get out of it. Let's yeah, do let's random see, one yeah, million. Random. random one million. Random. Okay. <laughs> Forty-five. Yes. One zero. I had to count the zeros. How many zeros is it? Please use a smaller number. Okay, so let's, do, <laughs> right. let's do a thousand. Okay. Oh. Random one thousand. Oh yeah! Look at those dice. Yeah. <laughs> Two hundred twenty-seven. Mine was uh. Six hundred twelve. What about you, Alar? Oh, you got three hundred thirty-one. Three thirty-one. All right, Dutraka. Oh, Dutraka got three thirty-two yeah. thousand, so I think Jeez. he wins. <laughs> Look at that! At a, at a thirty-two thousand, you got almost thirty-two thousand. <laughs> that was a good roll, but you lose. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see what it does, guys. Let's let's check it out. I think you target it, an it, enemy it, and use it, and you get to see through the enemy's eyes. No, no, no! It makes you get closer look at them. Oh, oh okay. Binoculars. Like, well, it's, it's glimpse. I'm gonna click on it. Oh, I gotta have it in my main thing to. There okay, you go. So, so what what happened? You can see your eyes sparkling. Yep, your face is buzzing. You didn't get any uh, different view? You don't zoom in? Uh, yeah, it did something strange, but I don't think I can... Oh, yeah, it just made me binoculars. Like, uh, Yeah, so yeah. I can see I can see this guy's ugly face really, really up close. Let me cast it one more time when I'm looking at him. Oh, yeah, look at that, guys. Look at that. It's also a light source, by the way. He's much uglier up close than he is in person. Okay, anybody else want to use it? It's Jeez. still got three charges, so it's got enough for everybody to take a glimpse. Nope. nope. Uh, I'll take, I, a, I'll I, take I, a look I, at it just to see what, all right, what it here does. You go, brother. I have a spell that does that. I don't need it. Now, how do okay, you use I, it? Just neat. That's neat. Just, just put it in one of your main slots and right-click it. And come over here and look at this guy. So you can see it work in person. Okay, guys, let's check this out. Okay. And I will protect you, so don't worry about it. Oh, yeah, look at that. <laughs> that is pretty, pretty cool. Yeah, I like that, actually. Well, it's a little weird. This is actually where uh, Super Bits and Bob was, the other yeah, the, yeah. one of those earlier yeah, with videos. His, yeah, with, with Barbarian Shaman. With and this guy right here, this exact same Noel, was the guy that was too tough for him. He had two weapons on, and he was, like, hasted or something like that. <laughs> And he just wasn't able to kill it. So that guy, I think, notoriously is just a higher level mob, period. I think you're probably going to find, you know, in his rotation, you might get a blue one every so often, but that's going to be red. Now, I'm at 100%. I'm at 100% now, so. Okay, let's try this guy. Let's get closer. To, everybody else get closer to the zone, guys. I'll pull him back. Okay. So in that case, if the bad stuff happens, we let's can zone. this room. Okay. I don't think, I don't think we're going to, you know, have that much trouble with him. Oh, you got two. Oh, did I? Okay, that's going to yeah, be bad. Yeah, the other one is one of the weaker ones we just killed. Okay, so kill the weak one okay. first. That gets that, uh, you know, off of you. Okay, let me... Uh, or actually, I can just one. root it. I can just root one of them. Let me heal you up real yeah, quick. Yeah, there you go. Let me heal you up. Okay, so I got yeah, aggro on one of them. There we go. I got his target. Let me go ahead and root. Okay, I'm rooting the one you guys are attacking, so if you back up... I, I just okay. backstabbed the uh, left knoll. All right, back, uh, back, on the, uh, back on the big mob. 
Alar, let's let's take him down if we can. We Which yeah, we're yeah, doing. He's going down. Look at him. Yeah, we're doing he's pretty fine, down. guys. We're gonna make this happen. Super bits and bobs. If you're watching this, this is for you. This is vengeance. <laughs> Yeah. Vengeance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, <laughs> we're gonna kill this guy several times tonight, so that's all for you, man. Oh. Yeah, we're killing this guy in honor of you, man, because you know, no one stops super bits and bobs, baby. Hey, uh -oh. Except somebody who gives uh, you know the the creature two weapons for no reason, other than yeah. to be <laughs> somebody to be trolling. Mean. Or you know maybe they were uh, you know like they like he said they had charmed and made him into a pet and then forgot to kill the pet after that. Because if you leave that behind for somebody, that sucks. That really does suck. Or he died himself. Oh, you Man. did? Mm, I guess it could be, but he'd have to come back for his corpse, and he could just charm it again. So that guy broke. Let me go ahead and toss another root on him, and you guys can pull him back this way. Okay, go ahead, man. Careful, pull him back you a little bit. back into the zone. Uh, you got aggro, uh, Alar, so I'll let you... Yeah, don't well, go okay, towards well, the zone. Go, go okay. towards... I wouldn't go any further back than where I'm standing. That's okay. what I'm saying. If you pull well, him back yeah. towards me... You can bring him back. On him, guys. So uh, let's just, just tank him down. There we go. I pulled the pet off. Well, but he yeah. didn't like the fact that you pulled the pet off. Target He's like, listen, guy. guys, I like bones because I'm a dog. And, you know. Dogs don't know it's not bacon. That's right. They don't know it's not bacon. They love bacon, too. Meow, 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 meow. Yeah, I sometimes <laughs> feed my dog uh, raw bacon as a snack. I don't know if that's good for him or bad for him, guys. I love dogs. It's so bad. I've never intentionally hurt my dogs. Raw bacon? Is, is it? I mean, bacon? just chocolate is the only thing I know for sure. Yeah, they have antibiotics in their stomach, man. Dogs can eat almost anything except for antifreeze and, and raw chocolate. Which is weird. I, I've never really understood why they couldn't have chocolate. Yeah. It seems like one of the What's most that? delicious things uh, that There's we can have as, as uh, humans. actually poisonous. Oh, check this out, guys. It's another uh, magic item. Wow, okay. Oh, is it a mask? Where is it at? Yeah, it's right here on this guy. Oh, it's a not bad. Hide mask. That's not bad, guys. That's, yeah. I mean, it's not it's not Uber by no means, but it's not bad. It's good enough to make the list of stuff we can hand out hey. to newbies. And our yeah. monks. Yeah, there you go. There you and go. And our monks. Oh, yes. Yeah, our monks will benefit from that. Yes. But I like AC, AC's idea better as much. As much stuff as we... I can't wait till I get to level 60 or 70, uh, 70 or 80, 90, guys. Which, you want to uh, move into that first room? Mm, actually, can, level yeah. 60. Because then, I mean, oh, I'm definitely going to pay a lot of you guys back. I'm going to hook you guys up. It's going to be ridiculous. I mean, I'm looking forward to the day. Oh, yeah, definitely. And I know we're going to be doing that with the, the reses uh -huh. and things of that sort later down the road. And as a group, oh, yeah. helping people get their courses back will be a lot easier for us to do than, say, somebody else. But... Uh, for now, because the holidays are coming around the corner, I just wanted to give back to you guys. Now, by the time you watch these videos, uh, this one, for me anyways, I think is going to come out in like April of next year. So <laughs> you probably will have no clue what I'm talking about at the moment. But we're filming it, and it's it's close to uh, Thanksgiving time, and then we're going to have Christmas. So we have a few, a little while, a few more weeks before we uh, really have to do it. But should give us more than enough to get what we need to give stuff away. What day do you want to do it on, man? It's going to have to be on a Monday or a Friday. It should be the maybe the Monday before before Christmas. Yeah, yeah, or you know that that same week. You know, just if we can, whatever day we can manage to get on and do it, I think would be just uh, fantastic. As long as it's close to Christmas, as long as it's close to that holiday, people will get where we're coming from. Although I think they'd be happy to get it any day of the week, uh, you know, any time of the year because it's going to be buffs, it's going to be, you know, okay, armor guys, and weapons me. and moving to me. Uh, move to you, you mean? Because I'm move, not moving move, in. Yeah. I'm hey, not moving AC, in at you. Wait, hold on, hold right on. Code. Yeah, that, AC, move into me. Yeah, move, guy, come on. Go into the room to your right on, and around the right. Where's AC at? Where'd he go? He was right behind you. <laughs> I told him to move into me, man. He's not having any of it. So, <laughs> All right, I'm pulling that touch my no. Okay, because I don't me, like his face. Let me go ahead and sit down. I'm only at 40% here, guys. So, No uh, no wild pulls. As long as it's one or two, nope. we should be There's fine. There's one more around the corner in there, but that's it. Okay, and we'll get him after this guy. We'll give AC a little time to met up because a cleric with full mana is a beautiful thing. <laughs> Uh -oh. oh, definitely, definitely. Come if you can have... They're coming the cops. Through there. Come and try to snatch my crops. These pigs want to blow my house down. I'm oh, sorry, guys. <laughs> what? So, <laughs> they hit on hey, the ground hey, to the next town. Is Rock a link to ringmail coat? Is that better than what you're wearing? Uh, ringmail coat, let me look. I doubt it. I'm wearing bronze, I think. 
Pretty yep. much pretty good, dude. Yeah, 17 AC, uh, 9 weight. So, yeah, it has more AC on it. It's ring mail, yep. obviously, you know, plate Yo. is going to be more yep. with the AC. Of course what you're wearing has more AC on it because you rubbed off on it. That's true, guys. AC <laughs> joke. <laughs> it's classic. Come to this room. This is where a lot yeah. of people pull to. All right, guys, come to us. Group room. Nope. And what's this called? This, just, well, uh, that's what I room. call it. We can just group in here, and the puller pulls to this room. What do you All call right. it, though? Sounds good. I call it the group room. Group room one. I call it the rump room now, guys. Oh, yeah, because it has a couple beds in it, and it looks like some of them have yeah, been yeah. used. It's rock. Uh, wink, we can wink. get busy up in I here. I call right? you a rump ranger, but hey. <laughs> it's comedy, guys. <laughs> <laughs> it's comedy at its best. <laughs> <laughs> we just need a rump roast oh, now. Oh man, we'll be, I need we'll a pickle. Complete. I need a pickle, guys. I need and pickle. some onions and some burgers. <laughs> but I just uh, drink twenty ounces of water, so I need capers. a pickle. And I think, guys, uh, we're going to go ahead and call the episode here. Again, if you do enjoy these episodes, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe. Definitely leave comments down below. Uh, Hydras, you want to talk a little bit about your channel? Let them know where they can find you. What kind of videos you are producing right now? Guys, come and stay if you like if you like RPGs. I love RPGs, guys. That's my thing. Uh, we're adding a couple new ones in the future, guys. Of course, you guys have already seen the Neverwinter Nights videos, but we are, we're also uh, coming up with Star Trek maybe in the next week or so, which I'm really looking forward to, guys, as I am a big star, uh, big Star Trek fan as well as a Star Wars fan. I really don't choose or pick between them. I love them both, but uh, you know, looking forward to playing some Star Wars, uh, Star Trek, guys. So. Come out and check it out. And Bushido Boy, you want to tell them a little bit about your channel, where they can find you? Yes, uh, currently I'm doing videos. I just made a huge one. So I'm going to give myself a little time after that on the Steinamogok. So if anybody wants and never knew how to do it, uh, there you go. Check it out. Just take an hour out of your time. Uh, I'm also doing the Thief Deadly Shadows Projects. But I'm having trouble recording that one, so uh, I got a hold of. Um, well, uh, I mean, it's it's something that Skype, not Skype, but um, perhaps. What are you doing out so late? Got their response. And uh, again, guys, thanks That's for watching. You guys, we will definitely catch you all next time. Turn around, dude.